Welcome! Yes, thank you for coming back to my YouTube channel. And this is Mandy Rose. Hi guys! Thank you guys for coming back to my channel. Please like, subscribe, and comment of what you like and you don't like. Obviously you're gonna love Mandy because she is not only God's greatest creation, she's also like the prettiest girl I've ever oh, met. Oh, stop it. And, stop uh, it. and she, me blush. Yes, so beautiful inside and out, for mm -hmm. real. So Mandy's gonna show me how to do her makeup. Yes. Um, she, do you wanna talk about it or you just wanna Yeah, I mean, yeah. so basically, I don't do, I, we're, we're gonna go with more of like what I look like on TV, obviously, not so yeah. much of my natural she look. She has no I makeup do. on. This is, yeah, bare face. Like, I can't. I, I have a little bit can't. of a tan, which helps. You know how that helps. I was like, how do you have no um, um, dark? Like, I'm no, like, you don't have any either. either. Oh I'm like, God. okay, well, first, really quickly, um, my skincare line will be launching soon, hopefully. Ooh, so I'm just going to do like a little quick, um, you know, recap of uh, what I have and also just what I do prior to putting on my makeup. So this is the um, toner, rose toner. Okay. So Ooh. I like to put this on first. Yes. So just a little. I love that. Okay. You want me to do it? You? Oh, yeah, you <laughs> so do it. Yeah. Weird. No, you can do it. <laughs> so then I do my lifting serum and check it out. This is going to be the Ooh, packaging. I love but, the packaging. Um, oh, that's so beautiful. Cool, right? Which I put on after the rose toner. A little low right now. Okay. Ooh, that's a little much. Okay. I'll take a little. Is this oil? Okay. Um, serum. Oh, serum. So a little bit of serum. Ooh, just kind of serum. under your eyes. Oh, yeah. I, I have such dry skin, so... I never used, I used to wash my face, of course, but I never had like a good skincare routine. Mm. So now that I've been using all this stuff, and this is obviously in short, we're just Did getting through this. you say I have good skin, of course? N me? No, yeah. <laughs> I mean, of course I have great skin, but, <laughs> but, no, but I, no, but I never really had like a good routine. So oh, I feel like oh. now. Wow, you have such really good skin. Oh, thanks. Yeah. Um, I always took care of it, but like I never right. had my, you know, serum, my okay. moisturizer. So then my moisturizer. So this is your this, whole, what you do every morning. So I too. do this morning and night, yeah. Ooh. She's okay, used well. her own product a lot. So that's, Clearly, that's good. That's a good sign. That's a very good sign. I actually used it for like six months before I like, well, we haven't even sold it yet, but like before I like, or so that's not approved. a lot. But yeah, cause I needed to make sure like my skin was good and then it didn't like relapse or something, God mm -hmm. forbid. So I actually used it for like, yeah, probably can get more out of there if you kind of bang it out. Oh, and then yeah. last but not least, I oh, know. we're right love going for this. I'm really just getting the makeup. Yeah, I know me too. Is my favorite. It's the um, eye gel, awakening Ooh. eye gel, and you would love this because we always talk about our you know dark circles oh. sometimes. It goes right under the eye, and it actually has a little bit of like highlighter in it. So like just for every day, mm, like like a glow, like a little bit of a glow. Yeah. Oh my god. So get, get also, in there. I just want you guys to see how pretty this product is. Look how pretty. Gotta it is. have great packaging. I love that it's gold and pink. Of course, gold. Yeah. Of course, it's gold. And I love like the bubble gum. So pink you just dish. put it underneath. So your eye. I would just dab it, yeah, kind of like soft little circles under your eye, kind of where you put up here too. Oh, like right highlighter. highlighter. Mm -hmm. oh, it has like I mean it might be hard to tell, but in the light there's like a little bit of a glow. Ooh. Which is nice. So that's like in short. We're probably gonna do a whole nother video, sheen, guys. Though. Yeah. Like right there. Oh yeah. We're probably gonna do a whole nother video explaining all of the skincare in depth. So stay tuned for that. Yes. That's, um, for what we do, traveling 300 days out of the oh, year. It's so. I mean, crazy. we're sleeping in different hotels yeah. and you know, dirty pillows, not yep. to be gross, but like your skin yep. changes and it gets like. Yep. No, it, it really does. Gets you have to really maintain and take care of it. Here we oh, go. so I did get. I love this. Completely side note, I um got after Natty did my makeup. You know, yeah. she's a big oh, fan yes. of Scott Barnes. Of course. Um, so I went and I bought all of Scott Barnes's brushes. I want to get these. Um, yeah. <gasps> so these are all. Some of them are not. Some of them were not available, but like. This one, like, yeah. And I love the case these. and everything too. I yep. need that because I hate, I put my brushes in my yeah. bag. It's really bad. So first things first, what I like to do is, don't mind my mess over here, is use a little bit of this pore filler. Ooh. Cheap NYX, yep. but. NYX, pore, oh, yep. Yep, but um, a little primer. This one, this one, I forget who recommended it to me. I really like it though. Because it's really light when you put it on your skin. Yeah. Um, oh, I don't yeah, know if you want to see. When you put it on. There you go. She obviously yeah. uses this a lot. <laughs> it's dirty. It's, it's not a. It's not an yeah. ad. Uh, yeah. Brand, she's definitely used it a bunch. <laughs> Got a lot of use out of it. Yeah. Next is the foundation, and 
I know the girls in the locker room, uh, I think Lexi tried this the other day and she like loved it. Another like really cheap foundation that actually like I love, Revolution. Ooh. Found in Ulta. Oh. I don't know. I love Ulta. Yeah, but it's like real. it's not even like with like the designer like section in the designer section, but I love it. So um, that's what I use for foundation. Revolution. <laughs> Revolution. Yeah. Did you just start using this? Or? Um, I've been using it for a few months now. So, you know, really just like, just like, <laughs> you're blown. I have a lot of stairs. Oh my God. She has um, five stories of them. Yeah, it's way. like, seriously, such a workout. So I'm going to actually mix in a little bit of, since I'm like Snow White right now, <laughs> no, the spray tan. As you guys know, I love Do my spray you. tan. I'm going to mix some of my um, Charlotte Tilbury foundation mm. and with some of her foundation. Blend, blend, blend. Blend, blend, blend. So have you always done make? Like, have you always been into makeup or was it more when you got here and we have to do makeup I've, at live events? I've always been into it. Like ever since, you know, little girl and I have mm. three older brothers, I'd be in my room like doing it. And my mom worked in cosmetics for years. Oh, I didn't know that. Since I was little. So my mom would actually bring stuff home for me and we, you know, I'd play with it of course. And like, so I was always really into it. And that was like my side of like being like my girly side. Cause a mm. lot of times it was like, playing sports and um playing outside with my yeah. brothers yeah so because you're the only girl in your family right only girl mm -hmm. yeah so this is like kind of goes way back even when i talk about amrose and like you know brand story and all that it's like i always had this little like vision that like i and i always loved that side of me yeah. but it was always like hard for me to always do because i never had a sister i always wanted a sister mm -hmm. too, right? oh yeah i've loved I've, same way like i um so my sister is actually 10 years younger than me so um she i grew up my brothers are close in age and i same thing as like i was always playing yeah. you know softball or soccer or hockey with them and then but i loved makeup and skin products as long as i can remember for when sure. I started yeah. doing sprayless tan at 13. Oh my God, I know. Yeah. Really <laughs> I was bad. like obsessed. The tanning, uh, I know. Once and I fashion. That, yeah. yeah. Oh my God. Okay, so after my foundation, um, I used to always do cream contour, but I just recently started doing powder. Ooh. The Anastasia. Did you say Anastasia? Uh, Anastasia. 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 Um, powder contour kit. I love that. Classic. I do the highlighter first. Oh, um, I always go back and forth though too. Like, as you guys know, I'm really into creams right now. Mm. Um, but I sometimes, I love creams because I feel like if you want to go for a more natural look, um, not for WWE when we really need right. to be like, you know, glammed out. Yeah. yeah. Um, but I feel like doing powder sometimes goes quicker. You know, you, doesn't last as long. Or, uh, well, it just goes quicker as in like the steps to get ready. To get ready, yes. Yeah. 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 And this is kind of like even when I do, I, I don't know, I don't take my time too much. I feel like I yeah. could. I, I feel like I'm, I rush a little bit too. Like, do you, I am curious of why the concealer before. Because what I, then I do is a setting powder, the last thing. Do you feel that the highlighter gives an extra glow? Like well, a no, natural? It might. Let's do it. Should we do it? Yeah. But this, you know what? With this highlighter, it's not extra. It's not. So even when you shimmery, when I put it on, I think I kind of just do it as like the base before yeah. my contour. So she's taking. So I this. feel like, as looking at it, it looks very matte. Yeah. It does. Well, look it really doesn't. Matte. It doesn't show that there. So I don't. I. So where do you put it? All in your. So I know I'm jumping, <laughs> going too fast. <laughs> Uh, under my eyes. Also, I think it's darker. The highlighter is darker than my. I'm so pale. You're it's really not that pale. So control. I like to put it under eye, obviously. Well, now I feel like I, I'm messing up. <laughs> so in WWE, we only have makeup at television. Right. Which is on SmackDown, on Fox on Friday, and Monday Night Raw for on USA. Right. And then the rest of our house shows or tours when we used to be before this global pandemic, uh, we traveled the world 300 days of the year. Um, we had to do all our shows, we had to do our own makeup. Yeah, this is what she does on... Sometimes it changes. So, yeah. you know, I'm I'm a bit of a um, opportunist. <laughs> and uh, sometimes I don't really stick to the same routine. But you know, I'm gonna go back a little bit. Yeah. So we're Rewind. gonna go with my Tarte. 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 Tarte, Tarte, Tarte. Tart. Shape tape. Shape tape. That sounds like shape yep. tape. Yep. And oh, is it? It's Tarte though, from Tarte. Tarte. Yeah, shape tape from Tarte. I, I, I love this. this. So we are going to do under eye. Mm. 
Love that. Nose. You have like the perfect nose. Oh, thank you. People always think I have a fake nose. I was just about to say, did you ever get a nose? My down? nose is not fake. <laughs> so this is what I do for my highlight. Um, I'm a big fan of tape shape. Don't have any. Shape tape. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Another concealer it, I love too, you probably remember the NARS. Oh, love Biscuit. NARS. Love NARS. This one I sometimes do after because yeah. my, if my eyes are too, too um, light. Yeah. Because this is like a good color. Biscuit. Jeez, so nice. this for the contour is like this just sculpt and glow contour stick. Ooh. That I don't even know. It's really dirty. But I don't know where. I forget where I got it from. And what the... Maybe my friend Brittany gave it to me. I about love this package. Yeah, I but love like, sticks like yeah, that. Yeah, I don't know. It's, I like it for Ooh. contouring. Yes. Yes. So like... It's cool, so yes. I kind of just go there. Mm, and you don't have to do a lot with this because it's kind of dark. We gotta do a lot of blending with this. Mm. It's got a little sparkle to it too, I just I noticed actually. Yeah. And then we go here, nose. Yep. Tip, gotta get the tip. I'm so bad at, like, sometimes I feel like I shouldn't contour my nose because I don't do it like really well. I, I know, I don't either. And then sometimes when my <laughs> nose is contoured too much, I, um, it looks really fake though. So I'm like, oh gosh. Well, because you have such a perfect nose. You don't I need know, to. it's so hard to be. I think I just did a really bad contouring no, job. No, I think it looks fine. good. Now we are ready to blend? Yes, we are. Let's blend. Did you use your beauty blender? I do. Okay. I got it. I washed got it. it. I Me mean, too. We always mm -hmm. wash, always wash your beauty blender. Don't yes. just use a cleaner, like actually soap and water. Is oh what yeah. They say. Cause it yep. actually expands when it's wet and it, um, it blends better. Blends. Blending, I like to start under the eyes. I could have used probably a little bit more. Oh yeah. The shape tape, right? I think we gotta yep. blend quick. I was just thinking that. Oh, sure. Well, some concealers okay. start to set when yeah. they're there. I think tape shape is like, like one this, of them. Yeah, shape. And same with um, Urban Decay All Nighter is the same way too. Like if you oh, leave really? it there for, it, it's meant to start like setting. Yeah, so it actually. won't move wrestling or anything sport sweating related yeah um, tape shape or all-nighter the ones that stick and don't move i think are for sure better so blend blend actually i feel like it's blending well it actually is blending well okay so you. you took the okay. powder i need to do so, that too yep, i just worried. did a little bit of the two of these mix if you want or whatever so and you mix these two yeah I think that's good for you because you're not that tan. But well, you have very nice like porcelain skin though. Like Thank when you have you. skin like that, like you don't need to tan Thank all the time. I, I know with us on and TV and stuff. Right, we need like. to. So this is where I love this big brush of oh, Scott that's Barnes. Good. Can and you send me this thing later? Oh, I want to yeah. buy that exact thing. Um. So, um, Scott Barn is his big brush is made for blending. Hmm. So that's what I need. Daddy got me hooked on this. I have this what bratty you? old one that's not. I was gonna use my brush. I need I don't know. more brushes. Now we are on to the eyebrows. Ooh. Anastasia, Anastasia. Anastasia, Anastasia. 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 It's However all right. you want to say. Yeah. <laughs> brow definer is what I like to uh, use. Mm, I like to do a little that. brush first. Love. And as you know, Alana and I, when we are blonde blonde, we rock the dark eyebrows. Yes. I love it. Yes. Okay, so okay. I have been, I'm just like trying to lightly fill in. So I'm still oh, trying to do that. work the, yeah. um, learn how to do the brush out. So the kind of like the so brush out thing. you actually like brush it out? With yeah, I will like, full, well, I guess I can just use yours. Full. You have a brush on mm -hmm. So I just go and I fully will brush it out mm -hmm. as much as possible. So my thing is I have to not cut my hair on my eyebrows because I yeah. always cut them. Yeah. And it will be like super awkward at first, but then, no, and I'm still perfecting it, but then I just like stroke it as, um, and do it as That's cool. like, like that. hair. Yeah. And then what I love about this, actually, I haven't, I need to get this one, is that it's angled. Angled, you need so an angle. So it's even more yeah. natural. We're gonna go to the eyes. Love it. And I usually do this Huda palette, warm brown, obsessions, these colors. I like the rusty, the yep. maroon a little bit, orangey type colors for my skin tone and for my gear most of the time on TV. This is one of my favorite palettes from Me too. Huda. I love this palette. Yeah. Let's check it out. All, it's like all the bronzy is the in there. And what I like to use, I'll show you, but the lighter color for the actual like eye, I use 
So I'll mix mostly this one, this brown. Ooh. Love that as one. You could tell that was I'm the exact one I would with always it. use. Yeah. And then I do very little, but like a dab of that and that. So like a dab of that and that. Not too mm. much though. Okay, I love that. Let me get my brush. Sometimes add a little white in there too. And this is just for the... Um, so this is for the base? The base, thank you. So this one. Yep. And then a little bit of the other two? Yep, a little the, bit of those. Not too much of the orange. We don't want to be too orangey. And then, and then orange just for the base. Mm. You have great eyelids. This is when you know it's a good palette when all of us love it. Right? Because Becky that, uses yeah. the same one. It's I such feel like a good These colors palette. just go really well with a lot of our yep. skin tones. and. I've never used this color though, so that's interesting. Mm, yeah, just like I do a little dab, mix it up. Okay, so for the, the crease. crease. The crease, yeah. For the crease, I like to use either one, this one or this one. Sometimes this is too dark, so I like to stick with this one. And very little. See so what I just did like this, and then dab it. Oh, I've never. You know, I've never used those colors. Um, I would do the lighter one. Okay, yeah. I was just thinking. When it comes out, it's like not a lot. It's, it's you blend it right on that crease. So the maroon. Yeah, it's like oh, more this maroon. This is so pretty. Isn't that pretty maroon? I love that. Okay, so let me say. Oh, yours look great. I was just looking. Oh, you did more of the corner, and I didn't well, really. Mine just got so much darker than but yours. But you can you look how green your eyes look from that color. That's why I do that color because your eyes, you. the green come out. Oh so yeah, much. no, that's what I love about the. How'd you um, do this guy without like a tape or something? I it think, just goes like that with your eyebrow. Yeah, no, I just kind of. Um, well, I was trying to figure out why mine were getting so dark, but I think once again, it's because you have more space than I do. Maybe and that's so mine why, is yeah. like, I, I should have probably even put less, but what I did was I just, when I went to like do the angle. darker, I just used a smaller brush oh, I should and I just crease. I love it. this Sephora brush though for the oh, um, crease. Cause oh, look yeah. at that. Okay. So what we're going to do next is uh, lashes. Okay. I'm a big fan of Lily lashes. I know I have a lot of other ones that I've tried, but the Mykonos are my favorite still. Not every day, I don't wear these every day, I, Mykonos. Guys, I, I wear gonna, them for TV. They're gonna look, if I, I'm just gonna show you how they would look on me, you will Please, not, they will I'm come out of my eyebrows. Why? Because I have, I don't wispy. have a lot of Oh, put it on your eye, I wanna say. No, I'm telling you, they're gonna be See, these are the only big. ones that look good on me. I have other ones downstairs too, but I have these, and I have, oh no, they wouldn't look bad. <laughs> These are my TV lashes. I don't go out. To <laughs> no, the they're store great. With they're these. not gonna look like they look amazing on you. Do you have really nice natural lashes? Do you always wear lashes? Um, I do not I wear lashes in life at all. You I don't only wear lashes on WWE, like at all. Those are my casual wear, and they look bomb on you oh like that. Okay, you're wearing those. Wear yeah. So I want to show you this little thing that my friend Brittany, oh, yeah, who um, owns Beach House PR company, sent me. This. Have you heard of adhesive glue? Mm. Um, is this like the liner, liner glue? It's velour. It's liner, but it acts as glue. Ooh. So you put it on Wait, the eyelash. That, that's not the magnetic one though, right? No. Okay. So it's lash and go eyeliner plus lash adhesive hybrid. So basically you use it for both. So Ooh. I put it on the lash, but then I also line it afterwards. Cause I have a problem using like white glue sometimes and then I get the white on my eyelash. Yep. But this I really like. You're probably gonna wanna put your own lash on, but. Um, oh yeah. And I could just show you. Perfect. So how long do I let it cool? You don't have to let it cool as much as I feel like the other glue. Okay. People will know that I'm not a big lash fan. And when I do have to put lashes on, I fucking hate it. Oh, really? Yeah. I'm just not the best with putting lashes on. It's I mean, hard. Especially, yeah. Yeah. I, I do love a good, like, individual, individual lashes I love. I'm obsessed. But I do not know how to put individual lashes on. I'm sure we could learn if we just sat there for a day and committed to learning. Oh, but for sure. What I gotta do is TikToks. I mean, we have a lot of stuff to do. I know. I, See, I, those actually, those lashes are like my fave. Um, I forget what the name of them are. They're still Lily, but they're. Oh my God, I, I'm gonna need help. Do you want me to do it? Wait, hold on. I'm so bad at this, guys. I am beyond bad. Do you? I used to be really bad, but oh my god, you use your hand, okay? But I do have a, I have one actually right over there. I no, I, I can't do that either. I just oh was yeah, no, I use my hand. Actually, I think it's coming up on the the top part. It is. Oh, you need more glue, I think. That's better, but it kind of came off the liner, so you might need to push it down a little bit. But what I think we should do is put this on top, okay? But make sure 
you go light with it and that it doesn't make your whole eye black because then we have to start. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, <laughs> after 30 minutes of after, attempting to put my lashes off, we actually had to shut back. the video <laughs> off because it would have been a lot of nonsense that you guys don't even want to see. But the lashes look really pretty on you. It's just, very yeah, we're going to, well, yeah. yeah, that's okay. Yeah. <laughs> so next, I like to put mascara on <laughs> your okay. real lash like and the lash. Fix. I know. I'm like, I think there's a lot of things I just put wrong. <laughs> this this brand is L'Oreal from CVS, believe it or not. But voluminous curved brush. And Always remember to get your real lash with your fake lash because you don't want to see that little dimension uh, of real and fake lash. Yes. You know what I mean. Truthfully, not. I would honestly wear a lot smaller lashes, but yeah. Um, I go for these big lashes for TV. I feel like they actually open my eyes. Yeah, they but really do. Everyone's different, you know? So she has like rounder eyes and she has more space between her eye and her eyebrow. Right. If you're like that, um, long lashes are great. If you're like me with a smaller like almond shaped eye and yep. less space here, less, that's, that's um, like my mom. She has to have like very small lashes. Yeah, so we just have to. We can't do all the fancy, fancy stuff like no, anyone with deep set eyes or less space. We just have to either different. right, just get the smaller lashes, like the wispy or the more natural, because they're still gonna really give that pop and open up For the sure. eye, like these are doing on her. Next, after we want to like maybe um, touch up our face if we you know anything under the eye, yes, like eyeshadow, whatever. Yes. I actually like to do the Nars okay. biscuit concealer. Love it. Um, under the eye. So you go and you touch up concealer after. Yeah. Um, I do kind of before and after. Yeah. I don't know if like maybe I'm doing something wrong. No, no, no. But I, this people have different techniques. I love, that's what I do. Natty and Chris Barn, they go and do all, all concealer even before they put foundation on. Mm hmm. And then they do. Oh, really? Yeah. Concealer before foundation? Yep. Wow. And um, I'll sometimes mix this and the shape tape, tape as well, by the way. I will I maybe too. put like foundation and then concealer, maybe touch up. If I have some really um, problematic spots, then I will just go and I will put concealer first. If I have problem, like have a bad breakout, maybe under the eyes as well. And then I put everything. And then after everything, I go back and put more. Okay. I always cool. do underneath the eyes like you do afterwards. Mm -hmm. The clean up the any residue that has fallen from the For shadows. Sure. And then I always go back and touch up any problematic spots. I just touched up a little bit um, bronzer too. I don't know if you need that. Oh yeah. We're gonna go with our problem. setting powder. That's I like it. Laura Mercier setting powder, translucent. Oh, I love that one. That's, That's such one a good I one. Love. And the great thing about that is that they sell them in small travel kits as I well. I know, I should get so the travel kit. So if you, anyone wants to just like throw it in a, not a small clutch bag, but you can throw um, in a purse, it's great. For sure. And I just like to definitely get under the eyes, by the nose. Do you put it everywhere, your setting powder? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I usually do too. Here it is. Ooh, so what I want. Which one do you think I would look good in? Um, so what he does, he goes like this. Ooh. And then this put but I really like that one, but it's really oh. if what he does, he I does wanna do that. all of it. Yeah. So yeah, so he goes boom, mixes it. You do right cheek? A, yeah. So with Scott um Barnes, I his, need to buy this. His Spending big this. thing is mixing so even with his bronzers or his highlighters, um and even his body Ooh, that makes butter of difference. how he did, he does a blend. He mixes everything. I love it. Pink I know, too. I really like that pink too. The bright pink. Yeah. And then a little bit of highlighter. Do you do highlighter too? Yes. I yes. this one. It's not, it, it's Too Faced. It's, it's pretty. I like it. I don't know, do you have a better one? Ooh, Scott Barnes. <laughs> it must be good. I want to try. Ooh. And I've been doing the same thing. I've yes. been just going like... I need a brush like that too for my highlighter. Oh, I love this highlighter. Oops, you go a little bit over here, lower. Yeah, I go right there and then right here. My lips, I never get too crazy. I've been using Max or lip liner for years now, and I'll literally do this. It matches really well with 
in my eyes. Ooh. And I'll put oh my like God, I love that Vaseline color, or Aquaphor on. And I don't, or a gloss, but I don't oh do like a color. I like some of you. This lip liner? Yeah. I have that. I think I might actually have that color on my gloss. Love, love, love. Oh, I love that. You know? Oh, we like kind of killed this look. Mm hmm. I'm not gonna lie. I love it. Right? Isn't it a great color? I've literally been using it. It's my, been my go to for years. I will not get go to a different color. What? Like, oh. Sore. We're almost done. Yeah. Setting spray. I'm a little this bit. This is Charlotte um, Tilbury. It's very light. It's Ooh. very, very light. Mm, if, I, if I just put it on without a uh, lip liner, it's like almost not like. That's pretty. Um, so I love it, the like blend and I might want to, of... it's so funny. We did like such similar looks. We actually look alike. <laughs> Our eyes and stuff. We have to get some good photos. Yes. That's pretty. Love. Okay. Oh shall we God. spray? Yes. Mmm. It's like extra glow. Wow. We look really pretty. I mean, pretty. not for nothing. We look really pretty. And like it. kind of twinsies. Mmm. Mm. Well, guys, we hope you enjoyed our little... Yes. show here thanks for having me oh my god thanks i learned for, a lot oh too oh my god thank you for coming um and doing this with me this was so much fun um i know we've talked about this for so long we have it's been so, a struggle trying to get together i'm doing yes yeah, so thank you um thank you guys for watching please subscribe um yes. and then like comment Please let me know what you guys want to see more of. I think we're going to be doing more of these together. So we are, for yes. sure. Uh, please let me know what you guys would like to see. Like morning routines, night routines, workouts. I mean, she's the workout guru. Literally insane. Her we body. can make that happen. So thank you guys for watching. Yeah. And yeah, here we go. See you guys soon. Thanks for having me. Mwah.